Kirpal Singh, the 6th of February 1894 to the 21st of August 1974, was a spiritual master, Sadguru. Singh was born in India in a simple rural house in the western part of Punjab, which now belongs to Pakistan. He earned his living as a government officer until his retirement, then moved to Delhi, where he founded his spiritual school, Ruhani Satsang, with its headquarters at Sawan Ashram. He was the president of the World Fellowship of Religions, an organization recognized by UNESCO, which had representatives from all the main religions of the world. He wrote numerous books, many of which have been translated into numerous languages. His basic teachings consist in establishing contact with God into expression power, called Word in the Bible, and Nam, Shabd, Om, Kalma, and other names in the other scriptures. Singh believed that the discipline of universal character defined as the path of the masters son mat, meditation on the divine word, or yoga of the sound current surat shabd yoga was at the spiritual base of all enduring religions. Life From youth, Singh sought guidance from various Sufis, yogis and mystics, but never accepted any of them as a master, and continued to pray to God to obtain a divine inner manifestation. In 1917, he felt that his prayers were answered. During meditations, he began to see the radiant form whom he believed was Guru Nanak, founder of the Sikh religion. In 1924, he met Hazar Sawan Singh, the famous saint of bees, in his ashram on the banks of the Bees River, and in him recognized the luminous form he had seen during the seven previous years. Hazar initiated him into the spiritual discipline, and from then on Singh dedicated his life to reaching the summits of spirituality. From early the 1930s on, when Hazar was asked if he had a disciple who had made great progress, he cited Kirpal Singh. In the same years, on inspiration from his master, Kirpal began writing the Gurmat Siddhant, the philosophy of the masters, a two-volume spiritual work, in the Punjabi and Urdu languages. It was published, on Kirpal request, under the name of Hazar Sawan Singh, starting from 1935. In the 1960s, it was published in English in five volumes. On the morning of 12 October 1947, Hazar Sawan Singh entrusted his disciple Kirpal Singh with the work of continuing his spiritual mission. The next month, Hazar approved the project of the Ruhani Satsang, School of Spirituality or Science of the Soul, Kirpal presented to him. Hazar Sawan Singh died on 2 April 1948, following a brief illness. After his master's passing, Kirpal went to Rishikesh at the foot of the Himalayan mountains, where he spent the next five months in an almost continual state of samadhi, or absorption in God. At the end of this period of intense meditation, Kirpal Singh received an inner command from his master, "'Return to the world and bring my children back to me.' He moved to Delhi, where people from Punjab were looking for refuge because of the division from Pakistan, and there began his spiritual and humanitarian mission. Kirpal initiated over 80,000 followers. Topic: Ruhani Satsang. In Delhi, Kirpal Singh founded his new school of spiritual research and realization called Ruhani Satsang, School of Spirituality or Science of the Soul, which would go on to have branches in many nations of the world. In 1951 he built the Sawan Ashram, in the neighborhood of Shakti Nagar on the outskirts of the city, where his spiritual talks satsangs were soon followed by thousands of people. He began to have visits from Western disciples. The first was Rissel Jacques, whose account of his six months at the ashram in 1959 Gurudev, the Lord of Compassion, encouraged others to make the journey. At the beginning of the 60s, an average 40 to 50 disciples stayed at the ashram from three weeks to six months. World Fellowship of Religions In 1957, Singh was elected the first president of the World Fellowship of Religions, an organization recognized by UNESCO, comprising representatives from all the major world religions. He held that position until 1971, and presided over four world conferences. In 1962, he became the first non-Christian to receive the Order of St. John of Jerusalem Knights of Malta for his spiritual and humanitarian work. 
On this occasion he received the congratulations of India's Prime Minister, Jawaharlal Nehru, and established a spiritual tie with him that continued with Prime Ministers Lal Bahadur Shastri and Indira Gandhi. <laughs> World Tour First tour Singh's mission continued to grow rapidly. In 1955, he made his first trip abroad to spread his teachings, and spent months in the United States and Europe. It was the first time an Indian spiritual master had visited the West. In those years, Eastern spiritual practices were generally unfamiliar to the West. Singh had hundreds of Westerners initiated and placed on the path of meditation, which he claimed led to contact with the divine light and harmony. In 1963, Singh made his second world tour, this time as president of the World Fellowship of Religions. He met with political leaders and other religious leaders, including Pope Paul VI and the Patriarch of the Eastern Orthodox Church's Atenagora I, and facilitated reconciliation between these two leaders after centuries of separation and misunderstanding. At the same time, he continued to instruct new seekers on the path of the Way of the Masters On 26 August 1972, Singh conducted his third and final tour of the West, where he received and instructed more than 2,000 new disciples of the path of spirituality. <laughs> final year In Delhi in February 1974, Singh organized the World Conference on Unity of Man. More than 2,000 delegates attended, including religious and political leaders from India and around the world. Over 100,000 people attended the conference in total. At the Kumbha Mela Festival of Religions in Hardwar on 2 April of the same year, Singh gathered sadhus itinerant monks and saintly men. In the Conference of National Unity, with the aims of promoting cooperation, eliminating religious barriers, and bettering the economic status of India's poor. <laughs> Legacy and succession Kirpal Singh was the first living master of the San Mat – Surat Shabd Yoga path of the audible livestream lineage to visit the West 1955. Kirpal Singh left his earthly form on 21 August 1974, at the age of 80. His death caused an intense successional dispute amongst his followers. In 1963, he had declared that he knew of no one competent to be his successor. One of the recognized successors was Darshan Singh. However, Russell Perkins, leader of the San Bani Ashram in the United States, which had been responsible for Singh's publishing, did not recognize Darshan, but instead supported Ajayb Singh. Aaron Stevens also joined in supporting Ajayb, although he later rejected Ajayb and left the movement. Thakur Singh also claimed succession, as did Judith Lamlion. Reno Sarine led the Rouhani Satsang organization in rejecting all successors. These succession disputes ultimately led to the proliferation of satsangs without connection to any descendant of Singh's tradition. As of 2002, there were approximately 200,000 adherents of groups associated with Kirpal Singh. In 1963, Singh issued this declaration regarding his successor At this time, I know of nobody who is competent to take on this work, whether someone comes up in the future is in God's hands. Quote, he then stated, Whoever may come up in the future, I tell you most definitely that he will not be a member of my family. The original document can be viewed at Satsan Desh, the magazine of the Master. Topic. Available teachings Kirpal Singh wrote an extensive collection of books on spirituality, including The Crown of Life a comparative study of various religions and yogas, prayer, its nature and technique, spirituality, what it is, Godman on finding a spiritual teacher or guru, and The Wheel of Life on karma. PDF versions of Singh's books are available free online, as are MP3 recordings of many of his talks in English and Hindi, Punjabi, books by Kirpal Singh. The Coming Spiritual Revolution compiled, edited and introduced by Russell Perkins New Hampshire, San Bonnie. 
The Crown of Life, A Study in Yoga, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, 1961, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, Bowling Green, Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications, 1980 ISBN 978-0-942735-77-2 Godman, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonny, Bowling Green, Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications ISBN 978-0-942735-70-3 A Great Saint, Baba Jamal Singh, His Life and Teachings, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonny ISBN 978-0-942735-27-7 Heart to Heart Talks, two volumes, Delhi, Mr. A. R. Manocha, 1975-6, mentions Paul Twitchell. His Grace Lives on, USA, Ruhani Satsang, ISBN 978-0-942735-93-2. The Jap G, The Message of Guru Nanak, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, 1959, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, Bowling Green. Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications, 1981 ISBN 978-0-942735-85-7 Life and Death Combined Edition of The Wheel of Life and the Mystery of Death Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie The Light of Kirpal, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie ISBN 978-0-89142-033-0 Know Thyself, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, Bowling Green, Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications, 1983, Irvine, California, Ruhani Satsang Books ISBN 978-0-942735-06-2 Morning Talks, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, 1970, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, Bowling Green, Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications ISBN 978-0-942735-16-1 Nam or Word, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, 1960, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, Bowling Green, Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications, 1981 ISBN 978-0-942735-94-9 the Night is a Jungle and Other Discourses, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie ISBN 978-0-942735-18-5 Prayer, Its Nature and Technique, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, Bowling Green, Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications ISBN 978-0-942735-50-5 Seven Paths to Perfection Spiritual Elixir, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, 1967 ISBN 978-0-942735-02-4 Spirituality, What It Is, Delhi, Ruhani Satsang, 1959, 1964, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, Bowling Green, Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications The Spiritual Path Surat Shabd Yoga, The Yoga of the Celestial Sound Current, Irvine, California, Ruhani Satsang Books, Blaine, Washington, Ruhani Satsang, 2006 ISBN 0-942735-95-1 The Teachings of Kirpal Singh edited by Ruth Cedar Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, 1974-6, Bowling Green, Virginia, Sawin Kirpal Publications, 1981 ISBN 978-0-942735-33-8 the Way of the Saints, edited by Russell Perkins, Franklin, New Hampshire, San Bonnie, 1976, 1989, ISBN 978-0-89142-026-2. The Wheel of Life and the Mystery of Death, ISBN 978-0-942735-80-2. Notes <laughs>